Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video I will be sharing the latest release from uh, Hero Arts and I will also go over their um, my monthly kit and I think we'll start with that. So I will clear my desk and we can take a closer look. So it comes in this um, beautiful zip bag and we have the premium kit and we have the classic kit, I believe it's called that. I will have my little note here and the package to the side. So we have the classic kit. Here is all the content in that one. So we have to start off five stencils that are layering together. We have a coordinating, uh, uh, what are they calling it? Coordinating hard window frame cut. So it will cut out a specific place in the stenciled uh, background. And we have love you. Super beautiful and it's all connected in one die. So I love that. There are three core ink, uh, ink cubes in this set. We have uh, six sheets of camel watercolor paper. This is super beautiful. Can't wait to try this out. I have never used anything like it, so it seems nice. And then we have a sentiment, a sentiment set. So really, really pretty. We have all of these beautiful, you make me smile, be my valentine, you have my heart, you are the sweetest, sending you, and then you can pair it with other sentiments, hugs and kisses, smiles, happy valentine's day, XOXO, be mine, bestie be mine, and so on and so on. And two small flowers as well, super cute. So that is the classic kit, and then we have the premium kit. Sorry about the sound. So we have some, uh, we have 10 floral fancy dies. Super sweet. I see in the, the design team create a lot of uh, beautiful projects with this. Can't wait to start using it. We have this one and it's um, gold leaf flakes. Yeah, you can see. You don't want to sneeze when you're having this jar open. I'm just telling you, this will go everywhere. And then we have this beautiful uh, pink and gold metallic spray. Super sweet. And I don't think you're supposed to shake it that way, so you're su supposed to shake it sideways. Just to make uh, the shimmer not clog your like tip here. And then we have this beautiful, uh, it's called... Sparkle clear liquid liquor pen. Can't wait to use it. Super pretty. So besides the kit, uh, Hero Arts also released a couple of stamps and dies, and I will start off with this called. Uh, it's a stamp and cut XL, and it contains both the sentiments and also the I love you uh, die cuts. So this is a really fun one, and it's just called I love you and perfect for pairing with the kit and all of the rest of the content in this release. There is also two beautiful uh, fancy dies and this one is called uh, Chandelier and it's really large. I don't know if you can see with my hand here but it's a huge uh, die. It's much larger, much larger in real life than I realized that it was when I looked at the website. And this one is called Vintage uh, Bird Cage. And you have two birds, a beautiful cage, some hearts and sort of, um, sort of a branch or something for the birds to sit on. So those two are fun and will go really well with the rest of the release. <coughs> we also have this beautiful background stamp. This is red rubber and um, yeah. Uh, odd to Andy Warhol script bold prints. So really beautiful. Can't wait to use this. Tone on tone on paper is probably my go-to when it comes to uh, stamps like that. And then we have a really interesting one. This is Floor and Hearts cover plate. And I think this will create sort of no waste. You have a beautiful background pattern uh, that could peek through anything. 
and then you can have uh, anything on top of this uh, sort of a sentiment or whatever and the cutouts here you can use for different projects so that is something I'm looking forward to trying and you can see this has no outer edge so it will just cut the panel and you can continue your pattern in all of the direction if you want to have a larger piece then we have a stencil here really beautiful with this sort of bursting hearts um, and it's also called heart burst stencil super beautiful and then we have another die set this one is called love you so much cover plate and this could on its own easily create um, a stunning background or focal point or whatever it's really a nice one and you can see it cuts here but it holds the lines together so you will have one piece that will be cutting out you can do some inlay techniques and so much else with this so a really fun one as well and then we have three products left from this release and they are bundled up so it's the stamp and the dice so let's start with this one this one is called a uh, skunk love bundle and we have these adorable images so you can see inside of like I would say that this is the smelly air or something like a like a bubble here you are stinking cute cute with uh, scent with love uh, smelly later you are a toot happy stinking birthday love is in the air and you have all of these adorable images and what I love about these is that you don't have to color too much so you can just put down some gray or yeah whatever to make it look like it's white so it's an easy image to color in and you can get the dice and I also want to point out if you like to get the dice you have to do it at the same time as you're getting the stamp set because they are not sold separate then we have another really adorable one I don't know how to best show you these ones probably by doing this I should have done it with the other one as well so here is um, love bird and friends so you have sending a sweet uh, serenade key to my heart our friendship is a melody that never ends you are the sweetest sweet uh, sweetest so you have the birds and you have this like locker with the bunnies inside super sweet and the birds yeah super sweet set and you have a little branch as well that the bird can sit on and coordinating dice also for the sentiments if you like that and the last but not least uh, this is the valentine reef and you have this beautiful reef with flowers at the center there you can also cut it out separately and raise it up if you like you have two smaller pieces down here if you want to create sort of your own shape and you have the corners here that you can stamp if you like so you have two my valentine from and to be mine uh, you are special to me sending you love so sweet so i hope to be playing with all of these amazing products uh, later in this video so stay tuned if you like to see what i created with this month's release bye so let's get in to some card making i hope you like that first bit of footage where i just gave you an overview of the new products from hero arts here I will go in and create with a kit and I will at the end also share a couple of other cards that I created uh, that you will see close-ups of over at Instagram during this, this month. Uh, but I just wanted to include some more inspiration. But you will see close-ups during the month. And I use paper pouncers from Picket Fence. Uh, I really love them. I have used them for I think a year and they have quickly become one of my favorite ghosts too. Uh, the minis are now available and I sort of used both uh, the regular size and the uh, uh, petite ones. I don't know what they are called exactly but I will have them linked to Picket Fence um, uh, shop as well. And you can see how beautiful this stencil is. This one comes in the kit, as I said, and it's called Laying Floral Background. And it also has a die to cut out a heart. When I had ink blended this entire background, I realized that I had made a big mistake. I actually inked up all of these pieces 
the wrong way. So the heart will not fit anywhere on my panel here. Um, so I created off camera a new panel. And by the way, you can see I have a, a sticky mat from Picket Fence in the background as well, just to keep all of my tools in place when I am doing all of my ink blending. So, um, as I said, I did a big bow boo, you can see here. Uh, that is what's fun with stencil, that you can mix and match and create new looks. Uh, but I should probably have checked, because there are some engravings in the stencils. I was just so eager to get started. But you can see, now I have two beautiful panels to work with. And this heart perfectly fits around a couple of these flowers. And you can cut it out and get sort of a two-for-one look. And that is what I will do for this video. So you can see I cut that out and we have this beautiful heart and we also have the, uh, I don't want to call it leftovers because this is really beautiful on its own as well. Uh, I created with the new heart burst stencil, uh, sort of a landing point for my outside edge uh, panel there. I also cut it down to be uh, standard A2 sized as a card front sized. And then I also splatter it with the um, uh, pink and gold metallic spray from Hero. And you can see how beautiful that is. And I raised my heart up with some dimension. I just used some foam squares that I had in my stash. Look how cute that is. And then I created a sentiment. This uh, U comes from the kit and the sentiment as well. For my second product project, I used love, love you. I had another banner stamped and cut, but I will end up using that on another project. But this comes from the I love you stamp and cut XL. And I also went in with that um, sparkle clear liquor pen and just used it and created some embellishment around my card panel. So here we have a closer look at our two products that we created in this video. I will also share a bonus card here in a second uh, where I use the first panel from um, where the one I ink blended in this video. You can see here I just used the Love You um, or the Love I should say uh, to the front of my card and then at the bottom I put Hugs and Kisses and I used the pen uh, one more time here and just created small dots. And yeah, that pretty much finished off our cards for today's video. Here are the ones that I created on camera. Here is the third and final card that I created on camera. And then we have some bonus sneak peeks that I will be sharing over at my Instagram account later this uh, month. Here I just some, did some mirror stamping. I did an inlay technique with that beautiful um, background um, die and then we have um, that background stamp with some of the coordinating die cuts from the kit as well as the large um, I love you stamping cut. So I hope you enjoyed this video and until next time have a great day. Bye!